Ladies and gentlemen, we now begin session five on attitude building by Dr. Bala Sandalyan. Dr. K. Bala is a result-oriented senior level management professional with more than three decades of experience in several verticals. It's over to Dr. K. Bala. Good afternoon, friends. Uh, this session is about Hello. attitude building. Unless you have a right attitude, you can't do anything. Attitude is everything. And that's what we are going to insist in this half now. Okay. Uh, you have some uh, stick here in this bag. And there are two pens here. And we think... Hello, hello, yeah. Thank you, team, for getting it ready. So that's the right attitude, you know, making it all right within few seconds. Please give them a big hand. We all think that the life is empty. The life or the world has nothing to offer to me. I feel it is very, very empty. But if I have the right attitude, if I understand my potential and apply my attitude in whatever I do and look what happens, you can pick up something from this empty bag as a gift and you may feel there is one Sachin Tendulkar, one Dr. Abdul Kalam who has been blessed with a lot of opportunities. And I am a very ordinary person. I am Admiye. I can't do anything. Again, 
you feel everything is empty in front of you but if you apply with lot of belief that something you can do once again you try your luck and then you can also become somebody like danush who's make it made it very big got a national award become son in law of rajini khan very ordinary guy okay you must be wondering we can pick up only gifts out of this bag i can tell you i can bring out a rupee note as well which i want to present it to the mma group captain who is worked very hard for this event will you please come up sir yeah no no this is going to become 1 lakh within few days i am giving it with lot of prayer please give him a very big hand nahi nahi ye aapke liye uh please keep it in front of the god who you believe and it will become lakhs within few months it's for sure and you must be wondering we took out two gifts and a rupee note out of this empty bag again we feel there are only few people in this world who are very very successful but if i again believe that i can it is possible it is amazing that i can take out one more gift out of the same bag it is you okay how do you like it okay i am going to call uh, you know four students from this will you please come up very quickly very quickly yeah one more one more please jump you are all very young okay have the right attitude of jumping into the dais okay have one balloon Test it yourself. Just whether find it okay, whether it works. Yeah. Okay, everything is okay. Just, 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 just. For a while, blow, blow and check, blow and check. Otherwise, I'll give you uh, another one. Everything is okay. Fine. Okay. Uh, my dear friends, uh, they are going to be given only 30 seconds time. And when I say start, all of them will start blowing the balloon. And when I say stop, they'll stop. Okay. it is not a simple balloon activity it is your life it is yeah you want one more okay it is your life it is your career it is everything for you in front of the audience okay you are going to show your complete courage your commitment and the right attitude okay let me see how big your balloon becomes okay are you ready start Come on, keep on blowing, keep on blowing till I say stop. Stop and hold it high, hold it high. You will know who has done the best. I think hers is the biggest one, and second, and third, and she has tri tried her best. Please give them a very big hand. And can you just tell me how you could blow a very big one? I just want to be. I mean, I just want to lead. So I. You want to lead. Once more, very big hand. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. The balloons are yours. Okay. Uh, can you just come, sir? Yourself, yeah. Please come. Very quickly. Very quick. Yeah. Uh, you have to bend down. and uh, sit down you just remove your shoes if possible and kneel down look at the board okay kneel down kneel down kneel down uh, just watch him i am going to give him very simple instruction that he is going to draw a line okay a horizontal line okay just just draw a line yes very good please give him a very big hand what is your name suren suhail suhail feels he can draw a line only to this level okay but i believe and suhail also believes that he can do much better than this can you just try without changing your position please try no 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 little above okay little above yeah very good once again big claps for him good suhail do you think this is your limit 
yeah draw better yeah little little higher okay just keep this also give him a very big hand don't move i am telling you this is not the potential or the height that sohel can reach he is still not has tried his best he is going to do it now can he do it now please isko piche lagao and now do it do it do it do it can you all give him a big hand hold it here and then a little more little more if you can if you can't clap he can excel further please give him a very big hand thunderous applause try now try now thank you sohel thank you thank you please get up uh can you give a hand mic please come here sohel yeah sohel please come here uh you just stand there and you are going to explain when i said please draw a line you did it here all of them clapped and motivated you went here and then you went here and you went here and i gave you the cap also which i was holding it in the past instance okay then when i told you keep your finger and try higher you did it here i can still assure you and promise you if you sit in the same position you can still go beyond this do you believe in it what made you to reach that much level i would say this is only a pass mark 37% 45% 58% 80% and 90% how you, you could make it how you could make it please tell all the audience so you asking me that uh, uh, you, you can do it you can do it you are, you are asking me so okay. that i think of myself right very good thank you so much uh, i must give you a very small gift okay Uh, for doing a very big you know job a small gift to you uh, this will grow into lakhs very very soon take care all the best good my dear friends in life even in your personal or professional life there are nobody to clap like this come on come on do it do it it happens in a circus okay there was a very important story i want to share with you very little story the yeah, house was locked for quite some time let us say more than a week and two robbers they were making a big round of the house and they found they can definitely make a very big deal out of the house and there was a very big tree also and there was a branch going very near to the balcony somebody has to walk on the branch and get into the balcony and jump inside bring out the a uh, possible money out of the house or whatever treasure out of the house they were looking for a guy in the day time okay and the search went on and on for a week finally they found one guy walking on the rope in the daylight okay everybody was clapping this guy is walking on the rope with a stick on and the both the partners decided he is my partner i am going to talk to him the moment he came down he talked to him we are going to have a deal meet us at so and so place at 11:30 in the night so 11:30 came and that fellow also came who did a circus in the afternoon and they told him the uh, secret of the project they asked him to climb on the branch he also did that and then they told him please go walk on the branch get into the balcony and bring the treasure we'll, we three will share equally and the guy was not at all moving so the partners asked him what happened you walked on the rope in the afternoon why are you not doing it on the branch now he said in the afternoon everyone was clapping for me if you can clap for me i will do it can he fit in this project now if he If, if they all clap for him in the midnight what happens can they do the robbery project it's not possible so he is a misfit in that project and they were looking for somebody else i tell you it is not the motivation of others you need to motivate yourself 
a self motivation is very very important and there is a very important story I want to share with you one more a very young couple okay they got transferred to one new city they got a new house and both of them were working they used to have breakfast together and while having the breakfast the lady used to see the neighbor you know drying the clothes every day and she makes a very big scream your clothes are dirty it happens it happens every day it was continuing for nearly 15 days it was continuing on the 16th day both of them again sat for the breakfast before leaving for the office and to her surprise the clothes were very very clean amazingly clean very very shiny and she made a very big shout today you have learnt how to dry the clothes it's very beautiful the husband said stop shouting I got up 4 o'clock in the morning I wiped off all the glasses of our window and that is why it is looking very very clean it's not that she doesn't know how to you know wash clothes every day she was doing the same thing but we were looking through the dirty glass that is why it was all looking dirty to us okay and I want to tell you one more thing you must have seen some elephants being tied with a train in the you know temple I have seen in Tamil Nadu it keeps doing like this okay in Kerala the elephants do like this I don't know what is the difference after some time the chain is removed the big a very big thick rope is tied again the elephant keeps trying to move out of the place and after some time the rope is also removed but again the elephant continues to do this do this and do this and do this why the chain or the rope was not in the leg but in the mind it has decided that it cannot escape from this place and some of you must be wondering I think I can't escape from this place because yes Sri madam is sitting 24 hours I have to be here my god like that don't you worry we are going to get several audience you know every hour and even if there is nobody the program is going to be on till 11 o'clock tomorrow that is the right attitude of MMA and sea change consulting can you give them a big hand and I tell you something one lady went along with her daughter to the beach why we go to the beach a very nice wave come and touch our feet we feel very good and what happened a very big wave came took away the child she screamed for help save my child and luckily one more wave came I brought the child back and there was no harm the child was perfectly all right but she gave two on the back of the child you know with a big shout means your footwear is missing what did you do she was not happy that the child is back without any harm she was worried the footwear is missing so that is the attitude of people if you can see something out of even nothing that is the right attitude but even after giving all of opportunities lot of facilities at home we still feel we have nothing okay now we are going to see a very very beautiful uh, presentation which is going to be very quick and I will not exceed my time for sure uh, see this is the attitude is everything and you can find opportunities where people see nothing see in Chennai a guy who was working in the government as a normal clerk started students rocks and he found a huge opportunity in Chennai so now he has several branches and how you think 96 crores of Indian population is having a mobile phone in their hand in some of the villages roads are not there buses are not there toilets are not there drainage facilities not there but mobile is there because 
of the attitude of the mobile facility providers that it has reached the last man in this country. Don't you agree with me? That is the reason. And now there is a big fear that 4 lakhs people have dropped using it because you can't send SMS these that. What is the kind of SMS that we keep sending to our friends? If I have to say that in local Tamil, somebody said Sunday aniki Sanda Pola, Monday aniki Monday Polama. Very nice SMS, yaar. let me forward it to 40 people. I tell you, with your mobile phone, the kind of applications it is available these days, you can check your PNR, you can book your Satyam ticket on your uh, mobile, you can do umpteen number of things and so much of applications available. What do uh, the fishermen do in Kerala? The partner in the boat, in the middle, middle of the sea, tells his partner, I got 400 fishes before the boat arrives back. The other partner in the, you know, sea uh, bank, he sells off everything. And look at the people who are in Singapore and New York. They buy and sell crores of money of stocks or phone. What do we do? You can see at least three out of five in the road talking over phone. There is so much of communication happening. So much of billing happening to the mobile providing companies. Are we communicating in the right attitude, with the right attitude? What do we do? Satya, Apro, how many Apro? It keeps on going, it keeps on going. But we must use the opportunity even if it does not arrive. And when I say ask right questions, ASK, if you ask for anything, you will just get it. Ask to the way, how to go to this hall, when is the lunch time, do you provide tea for us, why do not you provide pen and paper for us. Even Jai Shri Madam gives you less mark in internal, you can go and ask her, Madam, Rajesh has done so well. And I have also done the same thing. Why two marks less to me? You can ask. Then she may give you a reply. If you want permission, you can ask. For anything, ask. A stands for attitude. A stands for skill. K stands for knowledge. You get knowledge from these kind of workshops, in, you know, internet, from the books. Skill, like cycling, swimming, computer, various skills we get in our life as we practice. But Attitude comes from your mind. It tells you, for this customer, this is enough. For this program, this is enough. Why all of us should come at 10 o'clock? When I have my slot only at 12.15 or 12.30, I can always arrive at 11.30. Because we want to show that we are all one. We are together launching this mega event. That is the attitude. Don't you appreciate that? So, Ask the right questions. If you ask the right question, you will get the right answer. And then successful people rarely complain. That shows your attitude. If you have the right attitude, you will never complain. That means you will start to see what you have rather than what you don't have. If you start to see what you have, I just give you a small homework. There is no time right now. Okay, Just make a list of what you have, at least five things, maybe good parents, good house, maybe some of you having a good bike and mobile, and some of you are studying in this wonderful university, somebody is paying the fees for you, so five good things, and after this, you are going to get a fantastic job, because Jai Sri Madam's placement cell brings all the best employers to this university, don't you agree? Please give her a big hand. That means you have so many things in front of you, but you will still say, I have not got job in this company, in that company, Intel or whatever. You will still feel dissatisfied. I tell you, if you start to list what you have, you get three feelings. One is happiness. The second thing is confidence. The third is attitude of gratitude. You will say, oh Lord, you have given me so much. I thank you. Then what happens? Whatever is there in your mind list or in the paper list that you do not have, all those will get replaced in the list of what you have, which is called the law of attraction. You know the gravitational force, the earth can pull anything. 
the fire can burn anything same way if the mind attracts you will get it i can tell you a small example on 30th april myself i was traveling along with my wife in a car i saw a bus with a small hoarding on the bus satyam television 24 by 7 i told my wife uh, see i think i have not come only in this tv okay then what happened on uh, at the same na- night at around 9:30 i got an sms from my friend uh, see i am appearing uh, in this channel tomorrow morning 9 o'clock to 10 o'clock i'm going to talk about may 1 that is workers duties and responsibilities it is because it is uh, labor day okay so what i did i watched the program in between the scrolling number was going on then i also called up the number i got the line as well then i spoke for a while the companies should take some initiative of teaching the workers what are their rules why union should be there what is the purpose of the union what are the responsibilities of the union so then ir becomes hr so then after the program was over the producer asked my friend who participated in the program who is the guy who called in between can you just give his number and i got a call at 10:30 on the same day the program was from 9 to 10 So, are you free on third or fourth, sir? So I said, I have a program on third. I am fo- free on fourth. So that I got the opportunity of appearing in that television channel within four days. This is just a small example. I am telling you. So if you have something in you, you will not complain, and you will have to innovate and not imitate. you will find people who imitate also succeed you can take the example of virendra sivag who walks like sachin who stands like sachin he even he stands almost similar to sachin sometimes we get confused if the shot is longer one whether it is sachin or sivag but because of mirroring and matching we tell in nlp you are able to be successful Sachin scored the first double hundred in one day match, and Sevag also scored. In fact, beyond two hundred, it was two sixteen, I believe. And Sevag has scored three or two or three times three hundred runs in Test cricket. And if you find the call sheet not available for SPB, people look for Mano, who has also sung more than forty five thousand songs. And if in let us say in twenty four years. 25 years back if people don't get call sheet of kamal hasan who is busy they will look for mohan who is almost looking like kamal if ele raja sar is busy people will look for deva who is to almost do the same kind of music so people who imitate they are also successful but who innovate they get oscars i can take the name of ar rahman i think you will give a very big hand this indian music especially we are all so proud to have people like naushad saab vasant desai and then you got kalyan ji anand ji lakshmikant pyare lal kv mahadevan isai nyani those people have not got the oscars but ar rahman saab got it and because of his innovative and original tune that was the category he got his oscars and then every time people want to take risk there is no doubt but you must know you are taking a calculated risk if you are brisk enough you will take that risk as my previous speaker said if you are not brisk what you will do you will not even climb the first floor without a lift so you need to take little bit of calculated risk but i tell you at the time of crisis you must have read in the paper some one and a half months back which happened in madura while a grand lady her daughter in law and a small child three of them were going on the road suddenly one of the lorries came and the grand lady jumped in fact literally jumped she saved the child and she died on the spot so that was the kind of decision she takes immediately because of the right attitude she understood the priority so you you have to take the calculated risk and then take pleasure in helping each other 
I tell you, in today's program, more than 18 people are participating. And I have to tell you here with a lot of pride, each one of us having our own organization. We do not see see change consulting as our competitor and they also do not see as the competitor. It is a networking, we are complementing, the objective is same, we are trying to change the mind of the people. We are here with a promise to make a positive difference in people's mind and attitude in the personal and professional life. That is why we have come with a synergy, we are working together and I am sure when the program gets over tomorrow, this program is going to get repeated almost in all the metro cities within six months. I can guarantee that. People are just after sea change consulting and MMA. Please repeat this in our city also. It could happen in Kwaimudur. It could happen in Mumbai. It could happen in Bangalore. See, that is the pleasure of helping others to achieve. And it is not your career but life. Whenever we go for a work, we think we are working for them. We are working for the salary. Always think it is my life. Feel that kind of ownership. It is called intrapreneurship. Every manager has to work like a owner. That is the key. And then love to see everyone around you succeed. You learn and you make others learn. What happens? When you make others learn, you become a mentor. You become a leader, if you think, if I teach somebody, he will become little higher than me. That is the wrong attitude. You have to think that I am facilitating others. That is very important. And think before you act. Yenni tuniga karmam, says Valuar. So before you do any action, just think whether it is possible. Of course, there are a lot of cynics in the world. They look both sides while crossing the one-way crossing road. They check the original and the Xerox copy whether they are the same. It is photocopy only, but still they are so doubtful. They are not very sure whether they have closed the door. They are not very sure they have switched off the stove or not. So much doubtful, it becomes a obsessive compulsive disorder people say, psychologists say. So we need to think before you act and then meet people understand them, admire them. I am giving you one more homework today. Please go back home and tell your parents that whatever I am today, it is because of you. Thank you daddy. If possible, just give him a big hug. There are a lot of boys here more than girls. Girls can do it very easily. You can hug your mother but not your daddy. Okay, But still, if you do it, he will ask you, Inna Pana Venma. If you ask your mother, what happened? Do you love somebody? If you did it to your wife, she will definitely ask, did you go to the bar or what? What is wrong with you? So please tell them that you love them. And you thank them for whatever they have given you. If you do that, what happens? Your harmony in the family, it multiplies in fold. The ambience of the house keeps changing. So admire people, accept them as they are, don't complain. There can be only one Sachin, there can be only one Abdul Kalam and there cannot be one more person, everyone is unique. So if they have got any minus points, look at our own president. Within one month, he is making a big statement. I am a dummy piece, I, am, I become an antique piece and I can speak very freely, that is my advantage. But I can't do anything, that is my disadvantage. Can he be happy for another five and a half years? Whereas you can take the example of TN Session, who showed the world who is an election commissioner, what is his power? He showed. See, that is the kind of attitude I am trying to talk about here. And no means next opportunity. When I say ask, you went and asked somebody for some increment, some promotion, one more dosa even at home, they will say no. Today it is no because you are a dandachori, you are useless fellow. But tomorrow you are going to come back with an offer letter of let us say 10 lakhs per annum because you are from SRM University or any other university here. What happens? 
automatically the third or fourth idli falls in your plate without you are asking without you are asking you will be wondering what is happening that is the change so no means next opportunity and then demand excellence from yourself anybody has told sachin to score 100 times 100 centuries no anybody has told mother teresa to do social service no anybody has told bill gates to be the richest man in the country in the world no anybody has told see change to do this program no they are all self starters and not kick starters but most of us are kick starters do this do that but you prefer a self startup bike or a kick startup bike ask yourself ask yourself you prefer a self startup bike so demand excellence and be persistent even when it looks very very hard and then plan your 24 hours i have a special session in the evening about planning and organizing each one has got only 24 hours time and but in this 24 hours you can see there is a very big mega event taking place which has never happened first of its kind can you all clap and then the easiest route may not always be the best route how you think is everything and focus your time words action the message that you pressed which is gone the mail that you have sent which is gone the water which is spilled the glass that you have broken the words that you have said anything whatever has happened you can only regret same way you have to work like there is no tomorrow that is the right attitude ultimately aim for unusual success people think i am dark i am very small i am very short i don't know english no problem each one of few you have got your own unique potential identify that work with that attitude you can be definitely successful and attract what you desire and you will get it and don't wait for the right time every time is good only every time is good only okay and then best day is today because you have had the opportunity of listening 56 topics which is going to change your life thank you so much for the great opportunity i wish you all the best we have lot of sessions to go on continuously i thank the organizers for the you know wonderful opportunity given to me thank you thank you dr k bala may i now request ms susha john a member managing committee madras management association to please step forward to present a memento to dr bala so thank you dr bala for that very passionate and inspiring session